woman who has worked tirelessly to help Houston area children is now in need of life-changing help herself. 20-year-old Michaela Ashoff founded a charity several years ago to send care packages to chronically ill teens and young adults. She started it after being diagnosed with a disorder that affects her nervous system. Now Michaela is in desperate need of a critical medical procedure. Our Keith Garvin joins us live tonight with her story. Keith? Bill, Michaela is actually home right now tonight, recovering from a concussion after a fall related to her illness. But she has such a positive outlook and now is hoping for a procedure that could be her last chance. Life is very unpredictable. You never know when it's going to hit you. Life's been that way for Michaela Ashoff, better known as Mick, for too long now after she was diagnosed with dysautonomia six years ago. The largely unknown illness attacks her autonomic nervous system, leading to symptoms like fainting, extreme fatigue, and disorientation, to name a few. I'm in pain, um, migraines, sometimes seizures if it's really bad. In the midst of dealing with her illness, she founded a charity to send care packages to chronically ill teens and young adults who were hospitalized or homebound. That has expanded to a prom night for teens who were too ill to attend their own. But now Mick is the one who needs the help, a last ditch stem cell treatment that would reduce or eliminate her debilitating symptoms. The 20 year old is engaged now and wants to finally live a normal life. Just the hope that she could walk down the aisle on her own and stand at her own wedding and be able to make it the whole night without collapsing would be such a gift. And this is honestly I mean, my last hope um, of getting a chance at a semi-normal life. And the Ashoffs are hoping to raise $50,000 to help go to the costs that are associated with the stem cell treatment. If you would like to help, they have set up a GoFundMe account, and you can find that link in this story on our homepage at click2houston.com. Reporting live from Fort Bend County, Keith Garvin, KPRC Channel 2 News.